biggest quality of a good teammate is being understanding. You have to realize, especially with college, you know, you have a lot of different people coming from a lot of different places, uh, with our team especially. You have to really just be understanding of people and where they come from, you know, how they were raised, and you have to take time to get to know them, and, and that all stems back from, you know, just being understanding of who you're dealing with, uh, because you spend probably 95% more time with your teammates off the court than you do on the court. So if you can get to know your teammates, I think it'll, it'll grow that bond a lot stronger. Tiffany Mitchell, she's younger than me actually, but I think she's a good teammate because she's always staying positive even when things aren't going her way. Maybe she's getting yelled at, she's always staying positive and just trying to stay up. And she, although we may not see it a lot on the court, she does talk back when we go to the locker room, say little things. And that's really, I noticed that because she's a younger player and I've played with her for years and I haven't always seen it, but I've seen it recently as she's growing. A good teammate, somebody that always has their other teammates back, she always does everything they can to help out the team, puts everything on the line all the time. The, the best person is probably Ella. Uh, just help, just when we, we're down, she's there to pick us up and she gives us courage and faith and just lets you know that it's gonna be all right, it's, it's, it's almost done. Just push through this drill, get through this line and you, it, everything is gonna be all right. She was my roommate in the summer. She, so I think she displayed a lot of um, characteristics. She doesn't talk much, she's um, from France. So, I mean, she doesn't talk a lot. She's not really comfortable with it, but she communicated with me a lot about the ins and outs and things this summer. I'm somebody that's caring, somebody that's willing to help you through the struggles, and somebody's just there to motivate you when times get hard, you know, because coach is not always going to do it, so you look for it from your teammates. It's approachable, uh, knows what they're doing, you know, just easy to talk to, I don't know uh, what to expect and everything, just someone that you could just count on. What I think made me a good teammate is um, the fact that I care about. I'm not a selfish person. Um, I try to put my teammate interests in front of mine, uh, like the most that I can. Lisa, example of a good teammate, because when I first got here, it was I was struggling a lot because the pace was a whole lot faster, and I wasn't used to it. And practices, it was just kind of crazy for me. And when we had to do sprints and stuff, she was, you know. Because she is in my position, she was always encouraging me when we did position drills, when we did regular drills. She was always like, come on, Lainey, you got this, you got this. 